All right, so today we're gonna to be taking a look at how to import and export GPX files. And this would be in terms of maybe a shared file from one of your friends or uh, a race course file. So you can be able to uh, import this and follow the race course with our software here. So what we're gonna do first off is uh, we'll talk about establishing how to get GPX files. So there's a couple ways you can do this. Uh, what we'll be doing as a company is hosting these files. Uh, if you'd like to contact us, we can distribute these files to you that will work with our software. Uh, and so this will allow you to import them straight into our app with no issues. And so we'll go to our email here. And these, these files can be emailed to and from friends or uh, from us to you. Uh, so you can have any access that you'd need. So let's see, I've got a bunch of the Nora files here from uh, this week. We'll open up day two here. So we'll just do a long tap and import to Mob Armor. And what will happen is in the background, the app is going to be processing this file and importing it. So you'll still have a little bit of freedom with the app. Um, and then it'll kind of take, take control of the app. And as it loads in, uh, you'll be able to view this in the tracks menu. So when you import a GPX track from your email, it will move to the tracks menu once it's fully imported. And then from there, you'll be able to move it into a routes folder. I can show you here. Uh, and so in the, in, the, in the route section, we have the Nora 1000. So we'll be able to organize every day of the race all together. Uh, this is really effective. Say you're out in Glamis and you have this, this route that you went on that you want to share with your friends. Uh, really simple to do. From there, in the routes menu, all you have to do is email that to your friends and then they'll have the same files that you do. So you guys can all be on the same track and figure out what's all going on. So from there, day one of the Nora was just imported and it will import with the generic GPX tag here. Um, what I would do is go to convert route and we'll push it over into the Nora. And then from there in the routes folder, you can go to edit these. And you see we have day one here. So I'm just gonna rename this day two. And then we can toggle on and off which days want to be displayed. So make sure if you want to display the track, you toggle it on here. And then we'll back out and we'll just tap on Nora and it will zoom in and it'll actually show you uh, with some waypoints the first day along with the second day. And so you can import uh, massive files. You can import like, you know, this is, this is a couple hundred miles of tracking here. Um, and if you'd like, you can go and turn off. Once you're through stage one, you can turn it off and you only have stage two to show. So it doesn't crowd the map as much. So importing, exporting GPX files is very simple. I'll show you the export here. So if we go into the Nora and you wanted to share this with a friend, all you'd have to do is go share and then it'll bring up another uh, slider menu to email this out to your friends or uh, teammates so you guys can pass information on really easily. So from there, it'll pack up the information and send it off and you're good to go. So, thanks for watching.